I'm currently on the other side of the world at the moment in Canada from home, New Zealand. And what I've noticed traveling around the world is technology is basically doing the same thing to all of us. It's lunchtime at the moment. Have a look at this lady. She's just having a lunch break. Yes, and her work probably involves her sitting down in the same position, but instead of looking at a phone, she's looking at a, a computer. And in her break, she comes down here and she has to get connected to the world by going in the same position, but now actually looking at a, a phone. Now, what is this actually doing to her physiologically and physically, not to mention psychologically? First of all, look at her posture. First of all, she has a posterior tilted pelvis that flattens her back, so her lower back is flattened, her lumbar spine. She's gone into a kyphotic position, excessive curvature of the thoracic spine, as well as a poked neck position that over curves the cervical spine. Because of that posture, what's going to be the long-term consequences of that? Well, that's not the normal posture the spine is supposed to be in of the vertebral column. So that, that position is putting anterior compression forces on all, on all the intervertebral discs of the lumbar, the thoracic, and the cervical spine. Now, the intervertebral disc is made up of an outer rim called the annulus fibrosus and the inner part called the nucleus pulposus, which is more like a, <coughs> excuse me, a gel-like substance like toothpaste. And that constant anterior compression pushes the disc towards the posterior part of the joint that will eventually, over time, lead to prolapse dips, a bulging disc, maybe even a herniated disc where it starts to break through the annulus fibrosus into uh, the posterior part of the vertebrae. So that's going to lead to significant chronic challenges. So how do we avoid that? Avoid that position. So rather than just having a break from work, but also have a break from the work position. Get up, stand up straight, move around and move as, as the body is supposed to. And that will be no cow poo.